trouble, Mr. Walter, won't you? I've got my boss coming to dinner tonight, and I promised he'd meet my wife. You haven't got a wife? <laughs> no. But I was hoping Miss Foster might do the job for tonight. And she won't? Two years, and you've never once mentioned marriage. I'm expected to con this American freak just to save your rotten skin. Helen, listen. No, you listen. The answer is no. Hi. I brought some papers for Mr. Watt. I'm Terry Pringle from his office. Tell me, Terry, um, have you got any hobbies, like, uh, cooking, for example? <laughs> One of the big bosses is coming over from America. I've uh, promised he'd meet my wife, and I haven't got one. I was um, wondering if you might like to take on the job. No, oh, Mr. Watt! <laughs> oh, sod it. I've got rehearsals tonight, Mr. Watt, and I can't get out of it. Any other time, I'd love to be your wife in any way you like. <laughs> Stand by a man. Someone who's cleaned for you and looked after you for years. <laughs> if I can't ask my mother to pose as a man. <laughs> I don't know any other mature women. Yes, you do. Just look straight ahead. <laughs> what about the uh, age difference? You've never seen me with my hair done and my makeup on. They'll think you've married Madonna. see you again. I like to visit with all my young executives in their home. It's the only way to know a man's real character. Bill, this is my, um, <laughs> wife. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Jim, Jim, I'm terribly sorry. What a rotten cow I've been. Helen, what the hell are you doing here?